Oh, you're back. Um, what was I doing? Nothing, of course. What could I possibly be doing after you tied my hands behind me? Um, and you took my phone off me so I couldn't call anyone. Even checked if I had earrings or hair slides so I couldn't pick the locks on these chains. <laughs> yes, if I know how to pick a lock anyway. Um, but, um, you never told me you had a basement. I'd have thought it would have come up in conversation before we met in person. <laughs> um, you know, it's quite a normal thing to mention, actually. Hi there. The dog ornament you ordered for me is ready to be picked up. By the way, once you arrive, I'm going to knock you unconscious and chain you up in my basement. <laughs> Just would have been good to know. Why did you take a liking to me anyway? We haven't met before now, right? I'm just a girl who saw a cute dash hound ornament online and bought it from you. I'm sure I'd remember your face if that wasn't the only time we'd interacted. I'm changing the subject? No, 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 no. I, I already told you that I wasn't doing anything before you came in. I mean, how could I be? My hands are still tied behind the chair, just like you left them. Huh. Hey! You're hurting me! Uh, okay, okay. So, my hands are loose, but that doesn't mean anything. The, the knot must have come undone. I swear, I, I swear I didn't do it on purpose. What are you doing with that knife? Stay back. I, I didn't do anything wrong. I... Huh? You cut the rope. Are you letting me go? No? W what are you doing? Oh. Look, there's no need to cuff me. Okay, so I got my hands free. I, 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 mean, I mean, they came free without me knowing, but I, I, I still can't do anything. Please. Please, you say you love me, so... Would you do this to someone you love? You... You're, you're trying to protect me? Protect me from what? From who? The others? What does that even mean? You want to protect me from those that could hurt me? Well, right now you're hurting me. But... Maybe if you let me go, we can spend some time together as friends. Get to know each other? I'm not trying to deceive you. <laughs> um, I'll tell you right now that I'm a terrible liar. You just need to look into my eyes to know if I was being honest or not. Oh, that's a little closer than I was expecting. Could you back back away a bit, please? Hello? Can you hear me? Wait, no! Uh, you're so arrogant! Yes, I did just bite you! How dare you! S sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, did, I didn't mean to draw blood. I, I panicked. Are you... Are you... Are you okay? I I have a tissue in my pocket. Let me clean you up. Oh, okay, okay. I won't move. You get it then. It, it's in the left one. What? Uh, of course I'm not going to try anything. What is there to even try? Oh, come on now. This isn't necessary. That's rather tight. Do they need to be that tight? Look, I really didn't mean to bite you. You just caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting a kiss, especially not after everything you've done so far. If anything, with the way you're acting, I think you don't like me at all. That perhaps I offended you somehow? But I think we could work this out. First of all, I need to call my brother and let him know I'm not coming home for a while. I often travel long distances and stay in other places, so he won't find that suspicious, but he will start to wonder where I am if I don't let him know I'm safe. I... I am safe, right? Right, okay. 
Secondly, you need to open these cuffs and remove the chains so I can move freely. I'm not going to run away. I just don't think it's healthy to be pinned to a chair all the time or kept in a cold, slightly damp basement. I'm not judging you, but I can see the mold on the walls. No, 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 you, you need me to make that call. My brother will come looking for me otherwise, and then you'll get in trouble. I, I don't want you to get in trouble. We don't need to bring the police into this, do we? We can even hold the phone while I make the call. I promise I won't mention you or anything of this to him. So, you'll let me? Good. Thank you. You must know how this is when a family member worries about you. You'd do anything to reassure them. <laughs> that, and I bet he's forgotten the combination to his locker again. We go to the gym regularly and he never remembers his code. It's only through numbers. How hard can it be? <laughs> ah, you've got my phone. Okay, the password is... Oh, 7 -11. It's a bit of a joke in the family. They do amazing slushies. <laughs> Good. Now, go to my contacts and select the second one down. That's it. Hey! I was just calling to let you know that the gym code to your locker is 207, and that I won't be coming home for a while. I'm going to spend some time in the city soaking up the sights. Speaking of sights, did you see that weightlifter when we were there last time? Talk about overdoing it. He must have been carrying about 417 kilos. Fuck, dude. Anyway, I'll keep this short. I know you're busy. Talk to you later. Okay. Bye. <sighs> there. See. As I promised. I didn't tell him anything. Now, will you let me stand up at least? I did what I said I'd do. I got him off your back. You can trust me, see? If I was going to call for help, I'd have done it just then, and I didn't. Wait, where are you going? We had an agreement. Please don't just leave me here. I'm sorry I bit you. Please? Please?